Give up while you can, girl. All those who oppose Lord Ravanovar's perfect world will perish by my hand. I so swear it. Burning innocent people's homes? That's your idea of a perfect world? Wait with fear! village girl like you couldn't possibly understand. Well, your plan is evil! one-on-one, -on -one, are you? You haven't bested me yet, girl. Ah! Uh. What? Witch! With what magic have you imprisoned me? Imprisoned? Come on and show yourself, coward! You're the coward, spiriting me away with your village magic! Shut up! That makes no sense. And you're so loud. It sounds like you're screaming directly into my mind. <clears throat> well, I'll find you. I just gotta concentrate. <sighs> what is this place? I... Shut up! That's what I'd like to know. Well, this doesn't change anything. I'm still gonna destroy you! Try it. What? My fists won't connect! Yes! Wherever this is, if I can't kill you, I'm leaving you here. Goodbye. But I... I told you to shut up! I... <laughs> Poor Ashwat, my village, everyone. What will we do? I guess. I guess. Father, at least know I'm gonna make. Your father fought bravely. As a warrior, I recognize. You do not get to talk about him ever. We're gonna find this Ravanavar of yours now. He'll answer for what he's done here. And you can either help me get to him, or you can rot in there! Rebuilding the village will have to wait. Oh, I'll bring you to him. As a trophy. We'll see who makes a trophy of who. We're following your army's trail till we find him. Certain conditions, it seems. I'd rather not die stuck in your head, so I propose a truce until I can return to Lord Ravanovar. Ah, this is so frustrating! I can't get rid of you, I can't kill you, and now you can come. Trust me, if I could leave, I would. Thank you. 
have lost their trail. Where do we go now, murderer? Mine, if you mean to get to Lord Ravanovar, you should cut a path. I'd rather not let you group up with your buddies again anyway, so... Junk... stupid house. Did soldiers do this? They might have. All I know, I moved all the way out here to the middle of nowhere to get away from all the noise, and then here come these idiots, carrying on and taking my stuff. So I had to quiet them down, make them crispy, crisp them up real good. <laughs> Where are they? They're inside what's left of my house. Do you want to see? No thanks. I've been dealing with poor. What? Why? Maybe you can come with us. I'm trying to find my dad's murderous boss. Us? But there's only one of you. Oh, well, the guy who murdered my father is living in my head right now. It's kind of a complicated situation. You are definitely gonna get eaten by Vitala. What's a Vitala anyway? Keep hanging around here and you'll find out. You know, maybe we should get going after all. My house leaked anyway. So you're coming with it? <laughs> ah! Again? Where'd I go? Oh, where'd you go? There's a man in here who looks extremely annoying. Yeah, that's my dad's murderer. I don't know what his name is. I have told you, my name is Dar. I am the newly appointed lieutenant of the great Navar army, unifier of the... Ajna, I hate him. Uh... <sighs> Can't even get a good fire going in here. Were you trying to set him on fire? Maybe a little. Well, thanks for trying. So, do I just live in your head now? I guess? I don't really know how this... Hmm, that's gross. Nice to meet you, Razmi! I object to... If I must...
has its benefits. More importantly, what happened to this soldier? What was he doing this far from the village? Looting and pillaging, obviously. But my soldiers wouldn't do that. We had a mission. Don't be so dense. He stole my mother's axe and then he got killed. It's as simple as that. And whatever killed him is probably still out there, so we'd better make tracks. 